Hey, what's up everyone? Danny Lightning back with another CSR2 video today. We're going to talk about the fastest cars in CSR2 as far as tier 5 goes. It is now June 2021, all right? This list is always changing because they're always adding in new cars. So usually two or three times a year, I go ahead and make one of these, you know, top 20 videos or whatever. So here comes the top 20 fastest cars in CSR2, guys. These are the top ones right here. So we got number one, the Bugatti Bullide. We got 6.797 is the world record time. So if you look at that green time right there, that's the world record for that car. Number two, the Jesco, the Coenseg Jesco Absolute. All right, number three, Rides by Cam, Dodge Challenger, Havoc. That's a really cool car. The Chevrolet Camaro ZL1 1LE NASCAR. Next is the Aston Martin Valkyrie Track Pack. We got the Mazda Fury. The SCG007. All right, we got the Coenseg Gamera Launch Edition. The McLaren F1, but only if you get it up to level 50 on the Elite Customs upgrades. All right, we got the Brabham BT62R. We got the Hennessy Venom F5 Concept. Yellow. The SSC Tutoro Concept White. The next one is the same car, but the orange version. The crazy thing is they're actually different cars that run different times. All right, next one is the Hennessy Venom F5 Concept in red. Another one where there's up here is a yellow one. Now we have a red one. So two different cars, same car, but two different things. It's kind of kind of interesting. All right, then we got the Bugatti Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus. The Ford Mustang Cobra Jet. All right. We got the McLaren Speedtail. The orange one. The McLaren Speedtail. The silver one. The Coenseg Jesco Draco Red. And the Coenseg Jesco. All right. So those are the top 20 tier 5 cars in CSR2 as of today. Yep. Pretty nice cars. All right pretty nice cars i like these um new cars are always being added to these lists so they do change if there's any new cars that are out that are faster than one of these unfortunately it has not been added to the list yet but next time i make one of those videos it probably will be i'm not really sure if there's a car out there that hasn't been added yet but uh, these are all 6.9 6.7 to 6.9 cars guys so those are the fastest ones in the game currently all right, and I'm going to go ahead and run a couple showdown races with my LBNSX. That's the fastest car I have, which is available for the showdown. I never really upgrade the cars for showdowns. Whatever I have, generally, that's what I use. Because, you know, it, it costs you a fortune to upgrade every car you have all the time. So, another showdown will be coming up in about a day and a half or two days or something fastest car for that one should be the the prestige cup not the prestige cup car the milestone prize car if you can get the purple star version of that that will usually always be the fastest car in the showdown so whatever uh prize car your crew wins for getting all that rp usually the next upcoming showdown uses that car for the fastest car most of the time I don't upgrade those because man, that's a lot of that six, seven million game cash it costs to get those things upgraded. That's expensive. You know what I mean? So I'm just gonna run a couple of these showdown races out. Oh, they keep beating me guys. They keep beating me. I'm trying to get that 1,300 tokens or trophies so I can get that stage six part for the prestige cup car. And I'm only at what? 1,103? I gotta get the 1,300. So somehow I I got up to at least 1,200, I think. And then I must have lost some. So we're on a losing streak. We're on a losing streak. I should be winning because I haven't played for quite a while. So I guess I'm just off to a bad start. Sometimes it's kind of weird, but sometimes real early in the morning like this, I notice I lose. And then I do much better like throughout the day than I do first thing in the morning. And I don't really know why that is. I've always thought that was a little weird. 
think I got this one, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Got him. Cool, cool. We got to win. We got to win. We got to win. We got to win. All right. Get that morning coffee. 10.579. I, I guess this car can do a 10.4 something, but I don't think I've ever hit that once. I don't. I don't think I've ever hit that once. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Second, third, fourth. Oh yeah, I got this one. Nitrous on seventh. I don't know why, but I've always thought it was weird that seventh gear is when you hit nitrous on this car. It's either sixth or seventh. I'd have to look up my video on it again. It's been so long since I drive most of these cars. It's so hard to remember how to drive like 150 billion different cars, guys. I will tell you that. It is not easy. Not easy. I think there's like one more day left of the showdown, so... I hope I can hit that 1300. I'm up, up, up to 1,159. I, I hope I get back up to 1200 today. Maybe tomorrow I'll get to that 1300. Now I don't have any of the Elite Customs upgrades on this car or it would be a lot faster. Here we go. Six, seventh and nitrous. And on this car, you want to get those shifts as close to the green as possible. This car likes that. Not all cars like that, but this car does actually. 10.604. I'm not really sure what I did wrong on that one. I hit my 1200 though, so I'm getting close, guys. I need 100 more trophies. 100. That's it. 100. Come on. Come on. Come on. Now, I'm not going to watch those ads. You know, Jess, I'm making a video. Please stop spamming me with crap while I'm making my videos, Jess. Ask me some other time. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Second, third, fourth. Let's try all good, perfect shifts. Oh, missed that one, missed that one, missed that one. Those were all real close. All right, that guy had a probably a lead it out car right there, so he was much faster than I was. Currently, though, that... Uh, 10.6 again, man. I'm not really sure. But currently, that Honda right there is the... I think that's still the fastest Tier 4 car in the game. If you get all the, you know, Elite Customs upgrades on it, you gotta earn a whole bunch of those tokens, get it up to Elite Customs level 50. That car is fast, guys. That car is fast. I've never even upgraded mine. I kind of like it all black like that. All right, here we go. All right, fourth, sixth, seventh, eighth, and I think we got one, guys. Yeah. So on the showdowns, like when you have a really fast car, like mine's maxed out, or at least it used to be maxed out. Now this one can go up to elite level 50 and become much faster, so I don't know. I'm, I'm actually focusing my elite parts on the elite tuners cars. I don't really want to put them into more like the regular cars because I don't know. I like those elite tuners cars. They're cool. They're fun. It's nice to be able to upgrade those and get body kits and all kinds of stuff. I know there's another super coming out, right? Another like, like a 1995 super or something should be coming out pretty soon on the elite tuners cars. I think that's going to be amazing. I can't wait for that. So it looks like I'm on a losing streak. So I'm going to go ahead and stop doing this and come back later. All right. I'm losing too many races. So come back later. That's probably what I need to do. 10.6. He ran a 9.7. Man. He ran a 9.7. That car is actually capable of doing like a 9.4 something. 9.5 ish. If you max it out completely. It's a fast car guys. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and end this video, and I will catch you guys later. Please remember to like and subscribe. Hit that little bell. Set those notifications to all. That way you don't miss any good stuff that I upload. And we will catch you next time, all right?
Thanks, see ya.